all new students to doing this now. Today is September 5th, 2018. Today is going to be hot. I'm Mackenzie. And I'm Kayla. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <clears throat> Please be seated. Thanks to our flag bearers, Leah and Gianna, from Ms. Nago's class. Now for Seth Piscetti. Today is lunch choice. Today is lunch choice. It's our hamburger, popcorn, chicken, cheese salad, and PB and J and Christmas. Mwah! Back to this. Thanks, Chef. Our lifelong guideline is truthfulness and integrity. Which, oh no, yeah, truthfulness and integrity. Which means telling the truth. I will, I will, to, to build good character. I will not tell a lie. I will choose to do the right thing. Now for some important announcements from Miss Bones, Miss Clone, Tyler, and Professor Bones. Good morning, Sweetwater Pelicans. I am so happy to see everyone smiling, happy, ready to start school. I have one quick announcement that I want to share with you. We are we are tallying up the points in the cafe. And our top 20 points so far, third grade, Mr. Cedar's class. Yay! <laughs> Mrs. Kelly's class. And fourth grade, Ms. Muller's class. Fifth grade, Mrs. Williams' class. And Mrs. Faith's class. By Friday, we are hoping to have more students join us for ice pops in the cafeteria. Thank you for your hard work. Ms. Clark? Yes, I brought a couple pieces with me today. I know you weren't here the past couple times I was here, but I've been showing off portraits. And so I think first I brought on second and third grade's pop art portraits, and then I brought on fourth and fifth grade's emotion portraits, and now I've got to show off some kindergarten and first grade work. And so they've been working on some tempera portraits, just starting with a really easy to use paint. But first, we started by reading Stand Tall, Molly Lou Mellon. And it's a story about a little girl who really has to embrace her differences to figure out how they can make her special. Um, and so in the story, she talks about her teeth are a little large and she's a little short, but how it kind of helps her in the long run because she figures out how to go through life with a positive attitude. And those little things, those little differences, um, kind of surprise her in the end. So I won't tell you the whole thing in case you want to read it. But I do want to show you a couple pieces. This right here is Berlin Dean from Mrs. Stone's class. And so we started with a template to create a nice oval for our face. But then we talked about the placement of our facial features before we added in the tempera paint. And then we went over it with just a little bit of chalk here to put some color into our face, into our lips, and our eyes. So again, that's Miss Berlin Dean from Mrs. Stone's class. Really nice Berlin. And then... I have Wyatt Day, also from Mrs. Stone's class. Really colorful, colorful background. Um, we did use a brush when we painted the temple on the faces, but then we took out some really fun paint markers for the background. And so that's where you see some of that stamping come in, but really very colorful and playful in, in nature and just being able to embrace our differences and, and to put that on the paper. So nice job, my kindergarten and first graders that are working on this. A lot of creativity. Yes, yes. Thank you. Did we have anything we needed to announce? We have early release today. Early release, boys and girls. Early release. F-F-E-A. Did we have an announcement? The Jewish Federation helped supply local schools with backpacks and supplies for those in need. As a way to give back, we would like to help them collect unopened packages of toilet paper so they can donate to various homeless shelters in our community. Please place in bins outside of Ms. Martin's classroom. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everyone, for your contribution, and have a wonderful Wednesday.